everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Kelsey today we're gonna do a winter outfit video and how perfect it hasn't snowed this entire winter season and today while I'm filming the winter video it snowed today well it's snowing right now I have the window open I love the smell of like the fresh cold like crisp air love it anyways we're gonna talk about some tips for winter styling and I'm gonna show you I think I did five looks right yes five looks that are perfect for really cold weather okay so the first tip and first look that we are starting off with is a very simple look now one tip I want to start you guys off with I think I've mentioned it in a winter video before but it's so good it's life-changing so I'm saying it again is everybody knows about layering like psh, forget about that for a second when your outfits really cute layering can kind of be a pain because you're like okay I have this really cute outfit but now I need to make it warmer and I'm gonna ruin and cover up my outfit no you don't need to layer the opposite way layer underneath wear thermal leggings under your pants or wear like double sweaters under your sweater. Save you a really cute sweater you want to wear. Like I want to wear this sweater, right? Put like a nice fitted thermal long sleeve underneath and then put like a thicker knit turtleneck underneath and then I put this one on top. Boom. There you go. All you have to do maximum if it's that cold is put your coat on top because you are so insulated on the inside. So for the first outfit, I have these jeans. So they have these like they're insulated on the inside with like this really thick warm fabric. These things will keep you so warm. Like they don't let your body heat come out and they also don't let the cold air come in. These are from LL Bean. I, these are vintage. So I'm not sure where to actually get these exact pair, but I know lots of places sell jeans like this. So I have this gorgeous sweater on top as well. I love the sweater. It comes with like a little tie to sort of cinch it and then it gives this poofy look. It's from Revolve. And then this coat I talked about in my winter trend alert. And this is my like super puff coat from Aritzia. And this is like this very pretty beige color. For the boots, you can of course wear flat boots with this outfit. It, but every single other outfit I was wearing flat shoes so I wanted at least one look to have like really cute heeled boots so I did that but these are from Revolve as well. The second look was my favorite look. I love this look. I finally got to wear my horse coat. I have this horse coat that is so cool. It's like this cowboy. I don't even know what it is. I thrifted it. It was the most amazing coat. I've had it for like two years and I've never worn it before. But it's got this really cute, it's quilted. This thing is so warm. So it's really thick and heavy. Like I said, like picking this thing up is almost impossible. And it's this black and white, really cool horse print. And it came with a belt before, but I lost it. So I just used a regular black belt from another coat to cinch it in at the waist to sort of give me some shape. And I have the thickest knit white sweater underneath. And then again, as well, to keep extra warmth in, you can put another sweater underneath. And then I wore my really nice like tight black um, pants and then I tucked that into my rain boots actually so I have these really nice like shiny ones they're a little bit tall but they're flat the most comfortable shoes ever to just sort of like you know plop around in whether it's snowing or whether it's just really cold you can wear some really thick socks underneath which is exactly what I did and then I have this little like vintage furry headband this doesn't actually add any warmth um, but I actually lost my furry earmuffs that I wear every single winter. How sad, I know, I can't find them anywhere, so I have to get a new pair. But I decided to wear this instead. It gave the same sort of feel, so just imagine that they're earmuffs. Okay, and for the third look, we brought out my poncho again. I love my poncho from Banana Republic. So underneath, before we get to the poncho, because I layered that after, I'm wearing a nice thick cable knit um, nude beigey sweater. This is also from Banana Republic and then I paired that on top of the same black pants from before. I love the fitted look um, but these are a lot thicker than just wearing black leggings so if you have something like this I definitely suggest getting like a thicker pair of black fitted pants because these are my everyday winter pants. They seriously make styling for the winter a million times easier. Just trust me. These are from H&M, by the way. So again, you can get them super cheap, really nice, really fitted, really comfortable. And then again, more boots. These aren't the same brand boots. These ones are from Roger Vivier. Again, thick tube socks underneath of that. Put my poncho on top. And then also for extra warmth, I layered again with a big black blanket scarf, which you can either just sling over your neck or you can tie it all the way around, do whatever you want with this. And then I also put on a beanie. It's kind of like an all black look, but then breaking it up a little bit with the colored turtleneck underneath. Um, definitely monochrome looks are always in, but when it comes to dressing so much so with this much fabric, I like to have at least one piece be a different color so it breaks it up and you just don't look like a big blob. That's a good styling tip. The next outfit I did go for a monochrome look. I went for like a snowy winter wonderland kind of marshmallow vibe. So I started off with a white turtleneck as well as these white 
pants. I love these. Everybody asks me questions about these pants when I post them on my Instagram story, whatever. They're from Oisho. They're basically just like knit sweatpants and they're so comfortable, but I rolled them up and I decided to do sneakers for this. If you are going out in like cold, cold, like outside all day, you can switch this out for boots as well. And then I have this gorgeous poncho. It's a little bit different than the other one. This one just kind of goes over your head where the turtleneck is and then there's no sleeve. It just sort of slings over top of your whole body and it's this really pretty like light gray color. This is from Revolve. Again, it is so thick and super heavy. It really keeps all your body heat in. And then I also paired a white blanket scarf over the top of that. Blanket scarves are a really great thing to have in your winter wardrobe. They are so much more warmth and comfortable than just a regular scarf you kind of wrap around your neck because these ones, they go over your shoulders, they go over your arms, they can go down to your knees and you just like really just swaddle yourself in them and I love them. They're so good. You honestly feel like you're walking around in your pajamas. And the last look that I have, so I decided to do a really thick sweater dress underneath for the underlayering like I talked about earlier. I was wearing leather shorts underneath and it was hot in my room so I didn't but usually if I was going out I would put another sweater underneath and then a really nice tights and then I paired some boots with this. I got my lace up sort of combat boots instead. I thought that they would look a little bit dressier since we're going for a dress look but you could of course still wear like a really tall or knee high boot with this for extra warm and then this really big leather trench coat that is actually lined with like a furry fuzziness on the inside and then I brought my black leather gloves out. These are like my everyday gloves. I typically would style them with every single outfit. I don't know why I didn't. But um, yeah, I always keep these in my coat pocket, slip them on. My fingers are always like the first thing to go in the cold. So yeah, those are all of my winter outfit looks. If you want more winter outfit inspiration, go ahead and check out my Instagram. I kind of post what I'm wearing all the time on there. This well as my Instagram story, so I'm sure you'll get tons of more like outfit inspo from there. And make sure to subscribe to my channel for more fashion videos if you enjoyed this. So thank you guys for watching. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.